drawn to this area of the Mojave Desert since the early 1980s. The spirit of this place is ancient and palpable beyond time and comprehension. that provides alternative perspective with no shortage of inspiration where imagination is liberated. It's a location of a different scale. Superstar remembers her friends. I owe you one. I'm heading out on the road next week, and I could use a kick-ass tour manager. It's a full year, good money, first class all the way. Anything you want, Donnie. John, what are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Uh, it's a TV set. I work here. You have an answer for everything. Is this your brother, Lindsay? Until science proves otherwise. John Price, Esquire, at your service. <laughs> well, in that case, can you grab me that Moroccan oil? Seriously? John? What do you want? Well, I need you to help me pick out the lucky lady. Ooh, I'd love to, but Vanessa? Would also love to. I'm like the best matchmaker. <sighs> I like her. Oh. Yeah, I love her. I'd love to watch her model sports bras. Okay, we have a winner. Good work, team. Stuart, welcome to another edition of Off the Record. I've got an amazing star, literally. Uh, he's turned into a great friend, and he's also one of the most amazing drummers ever recorded. Here he is, Mr. Ringo Starr. I like to talk a bit about you know, drumming. Drumming, yeah, well, uh, we've got we... the drums there. Yeah, it's a uh... bit like...
And so it is that woundedness that allows the victim to carry the cross as it were. And the process of carrying the cross and cleaning up their act in simple words is not something that happens just at the level of the encounter. St. Augustine put it very well, uh, speaking about God, that you have made us for thyself and our hearts are restless. That is part of what makes life continue, but the deep ethic is that which is truly transformatory. And the deep ethic is what Martin Luther King was about, what Mahatma Gandhi was about, and many, many other people, but they are the ones who developed it and really made it into a socially viable practice. I don't have any money. For once, I'm not here for money. This is how it starts. By the end of the conversation, he'll be asking for money. Oh, that's nice. That's the way you introduce me to... My lover. My lover. Say it. My brother has a lover. And his name is Vincent. Hey, Vince. Thanks, Thaddeus, for meeting with me. I appreciate it. Hey, I brought you some Polish Kolochkis. Kolochkis is Bohemian. I didn't know that. You! You're an embarrassment to Fitz, but you're out. You're lucky Mr. Brown refuses to press charges. Whoa, whoa, you're not going anywhere. You should know that um, I am doing lots of work for City Chicago. Huh? My name is Yvette Gellis, and I'm a painter. What I really find fundamental to me and, and to my practice is, is the power of a, of a single mark. And I feel that in many ways, painting and, and mark making is really a question. And, and it's through the doing that you're finding the answer.